Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday season. So it's a new year, I'm back with some more reviews, so let's get right to it. Uh, I've been holding on to this for you guys for over a month now, waiting for some time to film this video. So let's get to it. This is the Sailor Moon Super S Petit Chara, one of my favorite lines of the 20th anniversary products. So let's unbox it. I'm very excited to show you guys and to take a look at it myself. We have a small lady, Helios, and some villains that we rarely get. So let's get right to it. Let's unbox this baby and see what gives. So let's take a closer look at the box. On the top we have Petit Shower, Pretty Guardian, Sailor Moon Super S with uh, some feathers and bubbles with a nice uh, bluish green tint which causes some transparency with my green screen but what can I do? Uh, so we have a nice window so you can actually see inside, uh, kind of like the Christmas collection. The other ones are opaque black. Beautiful boxes you don't really see inside, but here you get to see everything if you want to leave it in its box. You have a little side window as well. And the back with a picture of Helios and Small Lady with the villains. And even though actually the under has a nice brown design with some pearls with the same Tichara Sailor Moon Super S sign from the 20th anniversary collection. So let's open it up. Let's get take a closer look. So here we have them out of their box. Again, we had to stand separated like all the other ones come. So you have to just do some light assembly. Let's take out the tape over here. So here they are out of their box with the plastic wrap off of them. Uh, I personally take them out of the box because who wants this paper on top of it? I find it kind of ruins the look even though you can see them through the window. So again, if you think that these petit chars can get any cuter, they've outdone themselves once again. So tiger eye, cute as can be, hawkeye, and Fish Eye, Helios, and of course, Small Lady. So let's take a better look at these and I'll let you guys know what I think about the paint jobs. Sorry guys for my lack of judgment for using the green screen. It's actually causing uh, Fish Eye's blue color to turn violet and to turn Hawkeye's violet tights blue or whatever color it is. So sorry guys, I'm switching back to a pink background. So let's start with these three. We have the Amazon Trio from the Dark Moon Circus featuring Hawkeye with his spiky pink hair, uh, Tiger Eye, and Fish Eye. So again, the paint jobs on these are pretty flawless. I really have no complaints. Uh, all the little details from the face paint, the gloves. Uh, same thing for Tiger Eye. Her bandana is just perfection with her little symbol on her forehead just peeping through. Her face paint perfectly placed. And my favorite, Fish Eye. She's so cute with a little bubbly dress. Or sorry, a little bubbly outfit with her uh, fishbone on it. So again, very happy with these. So again, the Amazon Trio from the Dead Moon uh, Circus. So very satisfied with these ones, uh, very rare to get villains, so again we're very grateful for these. Uh, also you have on the stands, you have the Dream Mirrors, as you can see here, so each one in their own color. So Hawkeye has a kind of fuchsia, I guess, fuchsia pink one, uh, Tiger Eye has her yellow one, and Fish Eye with her blue one. So again, very nice, uh, so let's move on to... What we've all been waiting for, and the reason why I bought this set, I don't know about you guys, but I really bought this set mostly for Small Lady. I know a lot of people are a big fan of Helios as well. Uh, also, I know that for a lot of people, Sailor Moon Super S is their favorite season. Mine actually is Sailor Moon R, which I know is not as popular, but I digress, but I love a Small Lady. Now, I am noticing something on her chin. Hopefully, that's just a little something. I don't know if that's supposed to be there or not. I'm gonna have to check that, but I don't know what you guys think. Can you see that? Will she focus? Is that just too close for comfort? As you can see, she's got this little red chunk under her lip. It seems like a little manufacturing problem. Maybe a piece from one of the other eyebrows got stuck under her lip. So let's take it off with some alcohol and see what it gives. 
So as you can see, the alcohol took it off pretty well. Uh, so here they are all together. They look great, super satisfied. Uh, please like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below to let me know if you guys like this video and if you guys want to see more in the future. And also let me know if you have this set and what you guys think of it yourself. So I will be making some more videos real soon. So please stay tuned.